This, this, or that. Australian versus Korean chocolate challenge. Yes, so that's what I'm gonna do today. So let's see what the differences are between these Australian chocolate versus Korean chocolate. First, look at this one. This one, I've already opened it, not gonna lie. However, this is as Australian as it gets because they say here, it's a uh, Victoria, Australia. So they, they say made in Australia here. One of my friends gave me this one. So I was able to get this one. And this one is also, I, I was provided by that friend, but this one is technically, I bought it at a local store because I had them all. So this one, Maltese, Maltesers, I think it's called. And this one is called, what is it called? Cadbury, Cadbury? I think that's what it's called. Uh, this one is roast almond, roast almond chocolate. And then this one is famous Korean chocolate. So first of all, um, in the, this one is a huge block of chocolate that's, uh, that weighs about uh, 180 grams of milk chocolate. Whereas this Korean chocolate, the size wise, look at the size difference. The size is a little bit, so this one is huge, first of all. Whereas this one is Korean size. I don't know why there's size differences. Not to mention, does size matter? Maybe, maybe yes, maybe no. Which one would you like? Let's see, let's find it out. And these Maltesers come with this 12 packs of this one. And then it was like, uh, I guess there's a small mini bags inside here. It's made in Australia. And this one, made in Korea. Here, uh, Seoul, Seoulishi, so they make it here. So let's see what the differences are. First of all, it looks like this. It has a bunch of blocks and then I almost finished it. But anyway, the block looks like this. Whole block comes in like this. Like, and then, cause I, I, I don't, this one, hmm. you can break it, break it apart like, uh, like this, little breaks. So that's nice. So I'm gonna have a uh, taste. Let's see what it tastes like. Okay, it's very, it's very mild mild taste and let's see how this one holds up against this guy australian versus korean let's see so apparently the packaging is kind of interesting you can also tear it like here you take this one right here and then goes like that and as you can see there is this one, so you can take it out. And then, then there's this one, as you can see. It's got little uh, foils on top, and then you just rip apart the foil, and then you will see the, let's unveil it. You don't need that dress anymore. Yes, that's right. That's very good. And this is the chocolate that, uh, that uh, Korean, chocolate and uh, let's see how it tastes like okay hmm right off the bat the milky chocolate this one was very more I guess it was more buttery compared to this more buttery less buttery but this one has more, it's got more flavors, kind of like, mm, I kind of like even, it's a little bit sour even, almost soury a little bit. 
was more smooth, I guess. It was more smooth compared to this one. A little bit less smooth, but this one was more smooth. Oh, in terms of the price, right? Price difference. Now, price difference comes in here. This one was about uh, how many how many grams? This one is at 70 grams only. And I don't know how much this price is, but probably I can find it out in Australia. This one costs about $2, $2, right? So that was that, $2. I don't know how much it was that. And this one cost me about 144 grams total, 144 grams total. And then uh, the price was, I'll find it out. Let's see, let's try its price. Yeah, it was about $4, four US dollars. Okay, so let's see what that looks like. Maltesers comes in a little, this bowl like this. So let's see how this tastes like. I don't know why, but to me, this looks like a human treat, you know? Like, like, you know when you give puppies a little treats, like, oh, you did very well. Come on, take one of these, something like that. Like, why do they make it like these little balls? I don't know, but in Korean, this looks kind of interesting. To me, this is interesting. Um, and then inside there's like this cookie-like textures that uh, this one is not just a ball. It's actually a uh, little cookies inside. It's covered with chocolate, but it's uh this one is not good for me. Um, yeah, so so anyway, lighter way. They say lighter way to enjoy your chocolate, so they make you feel less guilty. I'm not sure if this is actually uh, a good way, but uh, you know, chocolate doesn't have to feel, you don't have to feel guilty about it, but it's just, you know, to me, it's a little bit too much. Uh, yeah, so, okay, so price comparison done and ingredients. I think the ingredients are pretty much the similar, you know, a lot of sugars, it's got a lot of, it's got additional, I guess, artificial flavors here compared to this one, maybe. This one is a bit different. Mm. Um, I don't know what they have here. The ingredients, probably, oh here, ingredients list. Full cream milk, sugar, almonds, cocoa butter, cocoa mess, and milk solids and emulsifiers and flavors. Oh, they, they got the different flavors too. Same thing as this one different flavors.